We're here. <laughs> it's Sunday, July the 30th, 834. Can y'all see? Come on. Go and focus it out. There we go. And we are about to meet our little girl soon. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, I'm a, we're gonna insert the clip yesterday from when Chance went with his Mimi. I love you. Guess what? The next time you see mommy and daddy, Ari gonna be here. Yay! You gonna be a big brother, <laughs> really? <laughs> you gonna be a big brother, okay? Y'all yeah, almost like, I was tearing up out here, I was crying, cause I told him last night, I was like, I miss my baby already. But next time, that we join up with Chance will be a family of four. I mean, we're already a family of four, but like in real time, like she'll be physical, like in her arms. Yeah, in the world. In the world. Yeah. And the content will be, that's when the content will start coming because I don't know how soon it'll be that we'll, you know, reveal her name or her face. Look, she's moving. Hey, Carol, good morning. But induction is at nine o'clock a.m. 8:35, so we're out pretty early. Don't have a long drive. It's just 10 minutes up the road. Yeah. But like you know, the women and children's entrance is always necessary to find a close park because oh, yeah. <laughs> they don't have many parking spaces out there. So I'm thinking it's good to still get there early because they said that I'm supposed to be induced at nine. So I don't know if I'm supposed to be there a little early, you know, to check in and stuff like that. But we pretty much like already had our hospital stuff packed. And we were just getting like little things together with the house last night and just making sure we added everything. I'm pretty sure I got every charger it is possible in my purse. <laughs> um, I even got a lightning charger too. But um, I got some water. They told me not to eat anything an hour before, which I stopped eating at like 7.45, 7.50. And I only ate a banana, so that's healthy. Um, yeah, I'm shaking y'all, I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous. <laughs> I am going to ask for like some pain medication when I get there though because my gums have been like they're giving me a headache but yeah <sighs> of course he's not long nervous nine months. <laughs> it has been a it's long like, nine months it's been a long nine months and I'm excited I'm excited to meet her me too I'm so excited all the moving around at night and the kicking her feet out, being sassy to people. <laughs> yep. I'm excited. But um I guess we'll update you guys along the way. Well he will mostly. Yeah. Um and yeah. So we're praying for a safe, smooth, easy delivery just like last time. <sighs> Quick quicker <laughs> this time that you know there will be no delays no complications that we won't have to have a c-section um, yeah. you know just praying uh, we even pray for the doctors and the nurses so it's important who you have around you um, on your team when trying to do something as big as this um, especially with giving birth like this is huge this yeah. is exciting you ready yeah. Ooh, no. <laughs> no, but yeah. <sighs> So, I'm out getting some to eat real fast. Right now, she's sitting in, in the living delivery room, just waiting for them to come. So, not a whole lot we could do right now. But I'm hungry. I gotta fill my stomach up before. What's up, y'all? All checked into the room, the delivery room. I got my IV to the monitors. Y'all, that IV hurt really bad. <laughs> My arm is like super, 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 super sore. Y'all, let me tell y'all, 
Okay, first let me update y'all. So, I did a cervix check first, and I was like one to two centimeters, and then she came back, and they were deciding on if they wanted to do the Pitocin, or in my IV, or the, it's like a little pill, and they put like up there near your cervix to help it thin out. Thick, still a little thick. So, in order to thin it out, she did that, and then they'll be back in four hours to check me, but I have to stay in bed for an hour. So, she, the nurse I have is amazing. I love her. She gave me a prenatal and some crackers because I ironed in a prenatal. So, I just ate like two packs of crackers and drank some water. But let me tell y'all. Rico Sutton <laughs> and Kimberly Atkinson. My mama, y'all. And Rico. Uh-uh, don't try to look down from the camera. Look up. Y'all, they went to the cafeteria. He gonna eat, sit there. I mean, just look. I mean, he was just looking at me eat that pizza, too. Staring at it. Look, currently still got gummy worms. And he know I can't eat them. And he had, like, four bags of chips already. <laughs> just two. Two bags of chips already, y'all. And my mama over there eating some chips. Trying to hide them in the bag like this don't help. And then they got the little baby bed set up over there already. Y'all, we talked to Chance this morning, and that baby is on a <laughs> hundred. Hooked up to the monitors. Whew. I'll be back soon. Great to us. Mm -hmm. So how you feeling? Mm, up and down. One to ten. Um, I really, uh, like, what do you mean one to ten? Like pain level? Mm -hmm. Right now, a, a three. <laughs> Alright guys, so no pain. Still waiting on a doctor to get back in here. And you have a little contract, uh, I said contractions. <laughs> contractions. <laughs> contractions. Contractions. So what's your PSO on our side? I think about six, close to seven pounds. Yeah, maybe seven. Oh my God, he just, wait, don't talk to me. I'm having an extraction. Hold on, see. All right, y'all, so they just gave me some pain medication. Gave me some Zofran earlier and that started working for some state all for pain medication but she said that they didn't have any more um they've been running out so they gave me some morphine just then and i felt i felt it when it went through my body but i told her i was ready for my uh epidural <laughs> i'm not ready to be stuck but i'm ready for it so i cannot feel any pain <laughs> to finish out this bag of fluids to finish out those bag of fluids and then a half of one and then anesthesiologists can come in and do the epidural but it typically takes like an hour for them to come in so I'm praying that these fluids just you know so that's the update I'm feeling the contractions still as 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 can like you know yeah my mama over here gonna eat your business uh uh look at this let me zoom matter of fact let me zoom in gonna eat this candy bar in front of my face knowing I'm hungry. I mean I'm hungry. Y'all I love me some Heath bars too. Yeah look here we go. You still hungry? Hmm? You still hungry? You need a meal? Like a full course meal? <laughs> we'll continue to keep you guys updated on everything so
about 44. And the contraction is coming back to back now. And okay. The baby is progressing a little bit faster now. And praying that she comes tonight or pretty soon. Let me know I can okay? So she's starting to have a little bit of pressure down there that she can feel. She just got the epidural probably about an hour ago, so things are going well. By the time you see this next video, this next clip should be arriving. Push, push. Oh, 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 o